Hello and welcome everyone. In this episode, we're going to do a quick overview of a new feature called Extend Grid Aggregation Capabilities that became available in Dynamics 365 for Finance and Supply Chain Management version 10.0.29. This feature allows us to add a columns footer, not only that shows a sum of the column, but also a minimum, maximum, or an average value. In order to demonstrate, we'll navigate to the page that contains the numbers. Here I am on the back order purchase line list page. From here I see the quantity column, so I will just move it somewhere in the middle of the scheme, right here. Now I will right click anywhere on the column, and from there I'll navigate to view column totals, and then select the sum. This sum function was available in prior versions. Now, if I would like to, for example, display a minimum value, I can just remove that, click on the plus sign, and then select a minimum value here. Now I see that the minimum value in the quantity column in this list page is one. Then I can also click on plus sign, do the maximum. The maximum value is around 19,000. And then the last one is average. The average is around 725. Don't forget to also save that view because we moved the column, we added a footer average. So we're gonna click right here, standard view. We cannot override a standard view, so we have to create a new personal view. We're gonna click on save as. I will say it's my view with average quantity. I will pin it as default, click on save then say yes, I would like to make a default in our legal entities. And next time I open the same page, I'll see my view, I see the quantity column right in the middle, and I'll see an average quantity populated on the footer. That is all, until the next time.